Um, you know, we're very fortunate to have someone like Rob. I think it's very difficult at the Division Three level um, that no one is awarded necessarily a full-time assistant. And you know, as you can see from the results of what he he does throughout every day, and as a teacher in our community, it's we're just very honored to be able to have him here at Stevenson as well because he does put in full-time hours here as well, and I really appreciate that. He's in charge of our offense this year. He's taken on some more administrative roles for us. I'm very lucky, um, you know, to be able to rely on him uh, if. You know, ever there's a time that I can't be at practice, I have 100% faith that he'll be able to run practice as if I was there. So I couldn't be more uh, grateful to everything that he does for us, and I think that he's an integral part of the success that we've been able to have over the past couple years. <laughs> Coach Slopek, can you maybe even guess maybe while we're here? I want a million dollars. <laughs> no. Not close. Not close. No. All right, everyone. So, Coach Slopek has been named the WBCA Assistant oh. Division Three Coach of the Year. I think it's just a great uh, award for all of us. I mean, you know, being with Coach Boswell uh, and what she's allowed me to do to allow me to keep coaching and do what I do from from Centennial and bring it to the college level um, and to be able to help the other coaches and have that freedom within the athletic department uh, and the support of everyone else it, it makes it a lot easier when you're allowed to go in some place and just coach and not worry about stepping on people's toes and not saying this or not saying that and being able to agree or disagree um, so it's a great environment and I think that's why I've been able to be successful and win an award like this because again of the people that we've had around us and the support so it's quite an honor. Um, I think the other asset that Rob really brings to women's basketball is just his involvement at the national level and that he sits on the WBCA board representing the assistant coaches for Division Three, and just being able to um, give up his time to be able to make sure that uh, you know the WBCA at the national level is doing good things as well. He's had the opportunity to present at our national convention over the past couple years, so he's always looking to give back to the entire um, sports for you know for women's Division Three basketball. I think it's a really big honor. I mean to be. Uh, one of uh, 430 Division three schools in the country. Um, I think it's a really big honor for our program um, and Stevenson in itself to put us, you know, a, our name out there again nationally of what we're doing and the support that I've had with the players that we've had, the coaches, and administration. So I think it's, it's pretty neat. It's, it's uh, exciting to be one of those people. Well, first I'd like to start off by saying congratulations, Coach Rob. Well deserved. You're the hardest working person here. You come in early. You leave late. You're just an inspiration. You always are like the most goofiest person in our circle, and I wouldn't have it any other way. Um, in the past four years, we've gotten really close, and I really appreciate everything you've done for me and this program. Well, uh, first, congratulations, Coach Rob, on Coach of the Year Award. Um, I really think you deserve it. I don't know anyone else that would be as deserving as you. Uh, you really put a lot of time and effort into making sure that we reach our goals for the season and really capitalize on all of our talent and stuff, and it wouldn't be the same without you. You've, to me, you're the one that recruited me, the whole reason I am here at Stevenson today, and I got to learn from you. And I can't wait to see how far you go. This is only the beginning for you, and I just, everything you've taught me, I've applied it in basketball, and I know my fellow teammates have as well, and I just can't congratulate you enough and those skills that you as a coach that you've taught me I hopefully one day I can use them with my if I ever coach one day and hopefully I can be as successful as you are. 